G'day everyone, uh, welcome to this photography tip. Uh, today I thought we'd do a Lightroom tip and it's how to um, synchronize settings um, between one photo and another series of photos or batch synchronizing all your settings if you like. So first let's um, open up an image and do some adjustments to an image and then we'll, um, we'll synchronize them to a couple of other images. Open up this one. So I'm just going to uh, do some quick adjustments in the develop module or you can hit D for the keyboard shortcut. Just going to do a, do a few quick sort of changes here. Um, drop the highlights a bit. Let me bit of exposure, a bit of contrast, shadows, the clarity, dehaze, just so we can you know, visibly see, see the images, see the uh, difference in the images. That'll do for now. So if we just go back to the library, library module and if you you hit the, the grid or you can just hit G for grid on your keyboard and that takes you back to the grid. So you can see now I've got three um, photos that are fairly similar in light and colour. And instead of going through and individually editing each one of those photos, what I can do is I can grab the settings from this photo here and synchronise them to these other two photos. So how we do that is we click on the first image first, this is the one we've just edited and then you select the other two, you can either hit uh, hold control and click both of them or you can select the first one and hold shift and then select the last one. So you can see there now we've got all three of those um, images selected in Lightroom and that activates down the bottom right hand corner here there's a sync settings um, button. So you won't get that. You won't get that when you've only got one photo selected because you you can't sync settings because you haven't got another photo selected. So you need to have multiple um, photos selected. So it's got our three photos selected there. So if we go sync settings and it brings up this screen, <coughs> um, you can you can see you got all these um, like parameters or whatever for for your photo. Um, you can check none or check all, you can just select what you want. Um, these are like standard ones that I've, I normally, um, normally just leave and when I sync photos I just do all those things. Um, if they're still the same it obviously doesn't change anything but um, if you have changed any of those parameters um, then it'll, it'll make the changes on the photos you've got selected. Uh, there's some that I don't do like if I do any um, individual transforming or cropping or spot removal on specific photos, um, local brush adjustments and things like that, graduated filters, you don't want to do those you know because they might not be applicable to the other photos that you've um, that you've um, that, yeah, that you've, no, yeah, that you've um, selected so in some cases they can you know you can synchronize them across but yeah, I generally don't prefer to do those um, myself. So once you've got that up, uh, all those parameters selected that you want to synchronize, you just hit the synchronize button. And if you just watch the photos over here, you'll see them. You'll see them change and change to similar colors to the other one. This one here, the sky's a bit bluer, so you might want to go in and and just knock the contrast or dehaze down a bit on that. So you might still have to do some individual editing to make them look a bit better. But um, Lightroom's a really, really powerful full tool for um, batch processing of, you know, if you've got a lot of images that are the same, you can go through and, um, and batch edit them all at once, which saves you a heck of, heck of a lot of time. So that's about it for synchronizing settings. Hope you enjoyed that tip. Catch you next time. Cheers.